Hi, my name is Dr. Hugh Feely and I'm a postdoctoral researcher at Cardiff University and I'm working on the GRS project, which stands for Diversity in Upland Rivers for Ecosystem Services Sustainability. Along with our partners in several other universities, this large-scale NERC-funded project is investigating the role of river organisms in some of the most important ecosystem processes that make rivers valuable to us, such as water supply, angling and wildlife. While many of us would like to believe that biodiversity is important in these river ecosystem services, we need a better understanding of how sustainable management of our rivers and their catchments benefits both people and nature. A large part of the Duress project involves using experiments in upland streams to see how river biodiversity affects water quality or the downstream transfer of energy needed for healthy and productive rivers. In our headwaters, a large part of this comes from the trees and other vegetation that line the stream banks. Vegetation falling into rivers is either fed on or broken down by many river species. In woodlands, many tons of leaf litter fall in. Therefore, it is important to get a handle on what happens to it. We also want to understand how different groups of river species in different types of streams influence what happens to this leaf litter. In an ideal world, we plant trees alongside the banks of different types of rivers to see what happens, but we don't have time for that. Therefore, a large ecological experiment is the next best thing. Over this 2012-2013 winter, we're adding several tons of oak litter to eight upland Welsh streams, which currently drain both conifer forests and sheep graze moorland. In each stream, we're measuring how invertebrates and microbes, such as fungi, respond to the oak litter we add, and to see how much of it flows downstream. The results will show us not only how microbes and invertebrates are important in leaf litter breakdown, but also how different types of streams found throughout Britain respond. Once we have our results, we'll be coming back to tell you how the results might help get the best out of our rivers both now and in the future. But in particular, this experiment will help us know whether we can improve our rivers and the environment by planting more deciduous trees along British rivers. You can find out more about the Jurass Project by following us on Twitter at Jurass underscore HQ or by visiting our website at www.nerc-jurass.org.